Right then. Let's continue with this game. Hmm. Well, we're gonna go back to the bull yard, I guess. I'll see the Vox and the police, you know, duking it out for the most part, I guess. This is definitely a proper weapon for here. Hey, got that guy. We got that guy. So basically the idea here is that, you know, the Vox have basically gone, you know, full rebellion here. Well, I guess we have to basically just push on at this point, so... Let's get going. Let's have a look around. Well, I don't see anything over here. Not the best weapon for long range is, is you know. So I guess I should probably get closer. On we go. Now I can do Skyline Strikes on the Vox if I want to, but I'm not really fighting them. Whee! What's over here, I wonder? If anything. It's a good thing that she doesn't get shot. Got him. Alright, push on.
Well, it looks like we cleared out the first bit here. See, I basically the Vox are in full, you know, fight mode here. I could fight them if I want to, but we'll be doing that later, actually, believe it or not. You know, this is what this game is really what it's supposed to be about. It's supposed to be about, like, you know, the, um, you know, the fighting between, like, you know, the, the Vox Populi and, and the Colombians. But I wasn't. DeWitt, Martyr of the Revolution, apparently. So yeah, I'll note that basically at this point, we're starting to like see like, you know, the um, the over like, you know, underlying theme of this game where like, you know, merging realities are like sort of like, you know, bending to each other. Like this is what this game's all about. It's basically about like, you know, realities and like, you know, the different paths we can basically take in life and what happens when like, they can, they can, you know, collide. Join the Vox Populi. They're taking no prisoners. Right, to the gun shop we go. to have been your wife. They said your soul was choked by the fumes in that metal box, but this I do not believe. And we shall meet again on that eternal shore. Both of us whole and smiling. I love you. I love you. I love you. So yeah, the Vox have basically risen up.
Yeah, I can like loot stuff up. People get mad. Isn't it nice? All right. Well, anyways, let's just get going here. They're like very short, you know. Although the like the end like game is very very short and like it's like you know um, setups. So yeah, we're just gonna go to you know back to um, you know who. Now you're actually getting to, like, you know, some of the inside little stars about this game, by the way. Basically, there's not a whole lot, like, you know, of difference between um, Fitzroy and, like, Comstock. And how they sort of act and, you know, deal with people. They might have different causes, but the people down, down you know, at the same, are at the same level, so to speak. So that's, like, you know, one of the better things about this game, like, you know, that little tidbit there. People are all the same, you know, despite, like, you know, what they basically fight for. All right, we'll continue on next time. But for now, I hope you guys enjoyed that quick, like, you know, episode. And yeah, let's push on. I slowly get through these, like, you know, and ending, like, you know, zones, I guess. For now, take care. Right then. I guess we're going to continue on. I don't trust Fitzroy to honor our deal. Rich, poor, a Welsh is a Welsher. <clears throat> Shoot the handyman in the heart for extra damage. Well, I guess Daisy's gonna hide over there. Cyber. Over Let's get that guy Tom doing some work. I still have to get the achievement for using that right, so. Let's just get going. might make sense. There we go. Kill that guy. Wee. 
You know, machine gun might be, make more sense here because you know these are what these weapons are, these guys are using. So we'll use the weapon that these guys are using, not the other way around. Well, let's just push on. Thank you. Got my vigorous stuff already, so... Just this stuff in here. Hey, where's the lever? Right there. Well, I guess we did it. I don't know if I brought us to a world where the Vox had weapons, or I created one. Yes, we don't know. Do, 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 do. Yes, everyone's dying. Well, that's fun to do. All right, we're basically coming back to stuff we've already searched, so nothing really new here. Guys, bleeding for their noses and stuff like that, of course, being a thing. Well, let's look around outside see if there's anything new, I guess. Before jumping into the shop here. Well, I guess we can't use that there, so okay. Trespassers will be shot. Alright, well I guess there's nothing new. Or like, you know, out of the ordinary from what there's already here. Huh. trick was a form of wish fulfillment. I got my wish. Alright, well, let's listen to his box of phone. Looks like I got a friend in town after all. Slate. He's fell in with these Vox Populi. And 
looking for irregulars, I will say. They are loaded for bear. The problem is, I gotta help them with their damn revolution first. Then we take Comstock House by storm. I do that, I get the girl. It's all about getting the girl. Alright, well, let's get going. Oh, they're coming to us, okay. Search the corpse, get the salts. Okay, that guy's cutting for us, okay. Well, looks like we have a fight over here. Push, push, push. Oh, she's calling out enemies for me now. That's nice. Pull that up. Whoops, that's my ally. It's four to four aligned. Oops, he's shocking everyone here. Booker, catch. What the heck are those guys? Take out the Zeppelin, okay. Let's see how we get up to the Zeppelin, I guess. Up, up, up. Well, that got me up here.
There we go, get that. You know, very straightforward. Oh, there's a Patriot in there. All right, almost got my biggest opportunity achievement. Here's a shotgun. Is there anything out here? Sniper rifles. Nothing on this side of Zeppelin. Ball gun, health kit, crank gun. You know, like the fact that they have like you know, um, you know, different types of like vigors available all over the place like for you, so you can basically pick them up whenever you want. Or it basically shows like you know, it's just not all the same stuff. Well, let's go find a way off. So just jump off? What? Where do I go? Well, I guess this is the right way over here, I guess. You know, I have a sinking position. I have to jump off, so... There we go. Well, they're chanting to it. Guess we go down here. Yeah, I can't even find where we're supposed to go at this point. That's kind of a nuisance, but whatever. Perfect. Found my way over. Is this the way we go? Alright, we'll take their heads, I guess. Well, another very, you know, action, action active place. Fitzroy's looking for blood, one thing for sure. Fink and her, her won't both be seeing, um, any sense, I guess. Alright, well, another small area basically done. I'm probably gonna, comp um, compile all these, like, into, like, a single episode, because they're so short, these, like, you know, last bits here. But whatever. Hope you guys have enjoyed thus far, and take care. Alright, well. I'm not that at this point I started combining like, you know, some of my like, you know, shorter episodes in this game. I wasn't going to do that, but 
I decided that when I have like, you know, 10 minute, like, you know, levels basically popping up, it's like, uh, I really don't want to upload that many videos of a game, you know, without, com you know, compiling a few of those levels together at least, so. There's gonna be like, there was gonna be like, you know, 17 or 18 or like 20 episodes of this game. It's probably gonna be cut down a lot. Like, you know, it's probably gonna be like only like, you know, 12 or 13 now, because basically if, you know, Compile like short episodes into like longer ones, making like you know, into like you know decent length ones, like you know almost an hour, forty minutes, stuff like that. But whatever. Let's just continue on. Let's go find Think. Fitzroy's looking for blood. One thing's for sure: Think and her will both be seeing the sunrise. <clears throat> the handman can temporarily electrocute skylines, damaging anyone riding them. Good to know. Let's kill that guy. The box pop player, pretty damn well armored, I guess. Do 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 do. That's interesting. We'll pick up those lock picks because you know we'll be needing them. There's another carbine. You know, I wonder if these guys will interact with, like the dead guys have killed or not. Like, you know, the guys basically like, you know, crushing their bleeding ble nose and stuff like that, like they do anything with them or just leave them alone or whatnot. Do we get to see them? Daisy said she was coming here for Fink. We need to take that elevator up. That at least to Fink's office. Ah, some gear. Alright, we got a scavenger's vest. Uh nope. Don't care. There's a vigor. Guess we looted that fine. Wasn't sure we did or not. Locksmiths! We don't lack locksmiths at this point, I guess. You gonna say anything? Guess not. The production of vigors and stuff. And salts. And one month being called, so right after we're basically done this little sequence, I'll just pause the recording here. Actually, I'm gonna do it right now. Never mind. Be right back. Mmm. Dinner's always nice. Alright, well, it sort of sucks that they stopped here at this point in the juncture of this game, but whatever. They're just right for each other, aren't they? Who? Fitzroy and Comstock. Mr. Lin? My god, I... I was so set on getting to Paris, I, I... didn't really think that... You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If... if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but...
think. I saw you die, Booker. Saw with my own eyes. That's right. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You, you just complicate the narrative. And there we go, vigorous opposition. So that's done. Got a tune basically for using vigor, some people. And yeah, at this point, the Vox Populi have turned on us. You know, I remember I can release stuff. There is actually, like, you know, an achievement from, like, you know, decapitations, I think, so I have to figure out how to do that. Undertow? That looks like a new vigor. Well, let's see what new this one does. Alright, that sounds useful. So right mouse to wash away your enemies, right mouse and hold to grab them and reel them in for punishment. Everyone, everyone enemies take more damage. Good to know. Well, let's just get the lock pip going. Fancy putting those lock picking skills to work. <clears throat> there you go. We'll get up there in a moment. Let's look around, shall we? I don't think we'll look around. Let's just go up here. See what's up here. There. Oh, firemen are killing us. Not sure we're going to get anything for using the burst gun, but I'll use it just to see if I get anything. Oh, that's painful. Need this? Much obliged. You know, I just seem to instantly kill him now if my uh, lead attacks are kind of stupid, but whatever.
You know what? Let's use this. Oh, the guard's like, hey, man. <laughs> Down he goes. I'll take that. Angry Stompers. New pants. Extremely low, low in health. Deal 2 damage damage. Just cool knife. Blah. Well, now I'm no longer able to speak, apparently. Elizabeth. You bet. Let's do that. Why not? There he is. Kill them. And there we go. No, 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 no! She's going to kill that child. Booker, we have to do something. We have to. <clears throat> we have to get in there. Come on, Booker. We've, we've got to get out of here. Boost me up. So yeah, basically, like, you know, she'll kill a child, basically, Fitzroy. Go. Is this it? Is this your movement, Daisy? This is what needs to be done. You see, the founders ain't nothing but weeds. Cut them down and they just grow back. If you want to get rid of the weed, you've got to pull it up from the roof. Wait a bit. Elizabeth. I guess it runs in the family. So yeah, I'll note that, like, you know, this is actually a very controversial bit of his game, basically. Like, you know, essentially, they're no better than, like, you know, um... The founders, but how basically like people interpret this was basically, um, you know, if you call like a bunch of like you know Mexicans rapists and then like find out they're all a bunch of rapists, that's basically what you're like saying here. Maybe the Mexicans Mexicans are rapists. Well, we can open that a bit. Let's just stay out here for a little bit to find out stuff. I guess we could have fought over here as well. Yep, we can sightsee. It burns. It all burns. But yeah, basically, like, you know, that wasn't very well received when you basically had, like, you know, Fitzroy, like, you know, doing something morally evil like that. People didn't like that for some reason. But, you know, part of the reason, like, you know, people didn't like it is there wasn't any explanation, like, you know, this game, one of the things it really fails to do is tell you anything. And it really does show. Like, it fails to tell you anything. I mean, you know, people are basically able to, like, make aware of decisions they're, like, you know, fast and want about the game as a result. Oh, she's running. There's our airship. 
All right, I'm apparently missing something then, so before we board the airship... There we go, that's what I want. Pick up the infusion. Uh, we'll take a bit more shields. Feel better already. And there is good old dead Fink. Alright, so yeah, Hooker complaining about Anna, who, like, is his dead daughter. They're on the airship. It's set to go. Well, let's just go set the course. I'm a working class here, you know. Alright, the bird and Elizabeth have some kind of connection. If I could put him down, would she let me? Alright, well basically we're done with uh, Fitzroy. And we'll get back to like the next bit, I guess. You know what, let's just continue until like, you know, we finish this little like, you know, sit back here. All right, it's basically like, you know, play a whole song, he comes back. Well, that'll be, like, good for next time, we don't really care about it right now. So yeah, basically, like, you know, that part of, like, you know, Fitzroy killing the, um, the child, that really did not sit well with a lot of people, because it's very, basically, like, you know, um, if you say, like, you know, uh, the niggers, for example, are all these horrible things, and then show them doing the horrible things, um, does that mean that everything that's being said was actually right? And people didn't really like that. Of course, that's not really what the theme of this game is really all about. It's like, you know, it's like a very, like, you know, shocking moment, but it's like, meh, who cares? It's not really the part of this game that no one's, like, you know, really caring about. At least I don't care about it. It's basically, it's, it's a game about, like, you know, realities, and, like, you know, different realities and stuff like that. And, like, you know, realities you select and stuff like that. The thing about this game is that it's basically about infinite, like, you know, universe theory, so to speak. And you have to, like, you square it out of way before, like, you think about other stuff. It's not really, like, you know, the content, like, you know, happening, like, you know, on, like, the outside that you really care about here is just, like, you know, the overall aspect of the game that you really should be taking away from it. And in many ways, I don't think it was done very well, but whatever. We'll get to that when we get to it. Hope you guys have enjoyed the episode thus far, and take care.